Hello, welcome! 22! So few days left to go. Let's get this door open. Oh my gosh, only three doors left to go. Here we go. Door 22. Let's open this up and in the meantime, <laughs> rip Emma's head off while doing that. We just decapitated Emma. But it was for Christmas, so that's fine. Okay, no, right. <laughs> this is not a good way to start this. Right, so we have got a little Christmas feast to build with candlestick in the middle. That's cool. That's a reasonably rare piece too. And a cake. Oh, all right. Okay, let's do this. So, good number of pieces in this little bag. This shouldn't. This bit. This shouldn't be too hard to put together. This should be reasonably logical. So we put these bits here, and then we hold them together with the green plate with the jumpery stud on it, and then uh, put it on the legs. And these ones go sideways so that they support the join in the middle, and then another leg on the other end. And this is a very small, <laughs> small feast table. But I suppose the micro dolls are small too. It just means we're going to be cramming a lot of stuff into a teeny tiny table space. So what do we have? Over here is where the cake's going to go. So let's do, well, let's do the candle first. So we have this candle piece that we've seen a couple of times now. Interesting to try and use this candle piece for other things other than a candle piece. It's really useful. But we have got candelabra in the middle with all the flames facing the same way because if they weren't, that would, that would make me very uncomfortable. <laughs> but, you know, it doesn't matter, really. But it would make me uncomfortable. And on this side here, we have got three cups. Three cups with pink stuff on the top. Mmm, delicious pink Christmas drink. <laughs> There's space for another one. Uh, but, you know, that we haven't been provided with everything we need for that. And we do need a cake. And cake is important. These are a lovely mix of colours for a cake. So, no Christmas pudding. You know, maybe it's a trifle. Though then it would be in a bowl, wouldn't it? But it kind of looks trifly coloured. I like trifle. <laughs> do you like trifle? I like trifle. A lot of people don't like trifle. I don't understand that. You know, soggy cake, cream, fruit, mm, custard. Mm, what's not to like? <laughs> Okay, so um, where am I going to put this? I mean, we could put it just in front of the kitchen where you would generally have a kitchen table. That looks weird there. So we might try and put it sideways here. Just kind of looks a bit exposed. It doesn't really fit in with the rest of the decor. Even the colours of the placemats don't kind of fit in. But anyway, we'll put it here. Yeah, look, that'll do. And it separates up the kitchen from the lounge room. And I've tried to break the mixer while we're doing this. Uh, maybe I could move this middle counter over to the side because there's a bit of space there and then we could move the table into the kitchen and that might look just a little bit less kind of exposed. It looks weird where it is. So let's put this here and put the poor old mixer back over here on the bench. And if I put it there, I think that looks better. I do. I think that looks better. That's better. And then maybe I could move, maybe I want to... I don't know. Let's leave it alone and find out what happens tomorrow with the next thing. I want to move the Christmas tree over a bit, but maybe I don't. Maybe we've got more things we need to add into this space. So I will see you tomorrow. Still got two more doors to open. I'll see you there. Bye.